Gaming and welcome back to my channel. Today is the next episode in my Stardew Valley series and I'm so excited because we're going back to the mines. So we're gonna go into the load section and find our account and we're doing pretty well. Look at that, we're, we're literally 30 like, I don't know, pounds or grams or G from 10,000 which is great. Um, I think the mines have really really helped. Actually, do you know, the mines have helped with money but I think they've also helped me feel more comfortable with the game. So as you guys know, we went into the mines, I think three episodes ago? Was it three episodes? It was either two or three episodes ago. Um, and we did quite a lot of stuff. Now this episode we're going back in, um, even though we have been in since, um, and we're just gonna do like some, um, we're just going to, um, we've got little tasks to complete. Uh, so we got the elevator back working in the mines that's in the other video and you saw in the other video as well that we got one of the, um, is it dwarf scripts or something? So that's pretty good. So we got the first one of that um, and we also got a kind of new little like task I think that was in our journal to, um, what was it, was it to kill like 10 slimes? We'll have a little check in our journal just after I've finished uh, doing my watering. Um, and we can see exactly what the task is um, but I'm sure it was just 10 slimes we had to kill and those are those little, I don't even know if they're called slimes, I take it they are, um, but those are the little things that look like the ginomos, the little good things, the little, like, little apples in the community centre and the little spirits. Um, so I think we've got to kill 10 of them, just making sure everything's nice and watered, I think it's alright. Now we're not going to plant any more seeds um, because it's nearly the end of the season so yeah we don't want to risk it. Anyway what I'm going to do unfortunately mm, now we said in the last uh, couple of episodes that the kind of best idea that or a good idea we could take into the mines with us is um, to always have some food because your energy goes down a huge amount. I don't think it goes down that much of an amount when you um, when you uh, kill the animals but it's more kind of having to break all the stones so what we're gonna do this time is try and find something we can forage maybe we'll quickly go down and um, just to the kind of wizard spit down here because it's always those you know spring onions and um, that we steal so we can eat them I don't know what they'll be like for energy hopefully they'll be quite good we found actually that parsnips are quite good for energy, which I was surprised about. And they had some health benefits as well. So I think the, the little bridge is just along here. Yep, here we go. So we're going to cross over it and hopefully find something to forage slash steal. <laughs> now can we eat this? Oh. <laughs> I don't think we can eat this. Oh no we can! That gives us 35 energy and 14 health. So that's good. And we can take these just as well. Um, so that means we can have an even longer day in the mines which is great. And it's not took a lot of our room. Um, I think I'm gonna sell uh, these ones though. Um, just so we can get something sold today. Um, because we don't have any crops ourselves um, so it'll just be based on the stuff we get in the mines so I'll probably get some copper ore and things and maybe if I'm lucky I'll get a quartz crystal or something who knows so we'll just quickly go back up to our farm um, and put those um, the kind of silver star um, spring onions just in a shipping basket and then I need to remind myself I need to remind myself to have a look at this um, little kind of uh, what do you call it? Like the journal thing that gives you all the tasks you've got to do. Okay, so we're gonna ship these. Yep. And now what we're gonna do is have a look at the journal. So, I think it's deeper in the mine. Oh, we've got to reach, there's, okay, so there's a task that I wasn't that sure about. We've got to reach level four in the mine, so we'll continue doing that. I don't know if we'll get 
um, to that level today because I'm not sure how far we're at already. I feel like we're not even past 10. It doesn't really tell you. I'll check on the left if it does. But to my knowledge, I'm, I'm not sure where we are. Um, initiation. Ah, okay, so there's a thing. If you can slay 10 slimes, you'll have earned your place in the Adventurer's Guild. I think that's that kind of building next to um, the mines. I've never actually tried to go in, so I don't know if you aren't able to get in until you've killed these 10 slimes, but hey ho, we're gonna kill these uh, 10 slimes and we'll get three more to do as we've already killed seven. So we'll get them done today most likely because they're everywhere, these slimes. And then uh, we'll be able to get into the Adventurer's Guild. So that's great. Anyway, let's pop off to the mine. I'm gonna try and not, um, do you know what? I'll take these because I can eat these. <laughs> but I'm worried about the time because I want, to, even though like it's good to forage and stuff and still have you know some money we want to spend most of the day in these mines because um, that is the purpose of this episode it's exploring the mines it's com um, completing the little missions we've got in the mines as well and I was do you know what, I was thinking what to do for this episode and I thought I really want to do the mines again because they were so fun and they seemed so like filled with mystery like we got those dwarf scrolls that I'd never heard about and I just yeah I love it and <laughs> it's, it's such a contrast to how I felt before I uh, started going in the mines you know I was telling you guys like I was super wary about it and I didn't want to go and here I am like I'm loving it so yeah here we are at the mines I'm just gonna <laughs> get my sword ready and we're gonna go now I think this is still broken yep um, and this bit still blocked off. We used to go down this little, I don't know, ladder slash hole, but now this works, which is great. Okay, so this is level zero. We can get to level five. So I take it that's the farthest we've been able to go down. So yeah, let's just... Our main mission right now is to get the slimes first. And there seems to be none here. Okay. Um... Right, this is a bit odd. Okay. Hopefully we'll be able to get these slimes pretty quick, I'm hoping anyway, because, you know, they're really not that difficult to... What was... Was that a thing? Ah, it was! <laughs> I thought that was just my eyesight, but it's not. Anyway, we'll kill this. Just see if it's got anything, you know, useful. Anything we could sell. It might be just kind of general bug meat again, but... Hey ho, we can always try... And it gave us nothing. <laughs> okay, but our energy and health still good. Anyway, should we try this? Ah, okay, this. Yeah, so unfortunately, the, I thought the mine would be able to take, the elevator would be able, able to take us even lower in the mines, but it seems that we've got to uh, still do that annoying little thing for, we've got to find that, you know, annoying little hole that always changes, which I'm not that excited about. Ugh. Ah, there's the hole. Okay, so we'll just jump down this one. Ah, and there's those slimes that we're gonna kill. And perfect, there's three there, so that is literally the amount we need. So that's perfect. Okay. Now I think, are these the ones that are the most jumpy? Or have like a more powerful... I stand behind this rock so you cannot hurt me. Ah, it's, it's attacking my my energy. There we go. And the final one. The final sacrifice. I'm getting quite a lot of hits. I'm not great at this, am I? Oh, and there seems to be a crystal up there, which is good. <gasps> Woo! So journal updated. So we'll just quickly check that. So now what we're going to do after... Probably just, yeah, probably just after this day we're going to go into the Adventurer's Guild. I'm not sure what time it shuts, um, so we might not actually get to see it today because I really, really want to spend a lot more time in the mines trying to get some more, um, some more kind of like stones or find more um, dwarf scrolls or stuff. Ah, okay, okay. It activated the rock there. I don't think that was going to kill it. Oh, and that gave us nothing as well. Now, what's this stone? Let's have a look. So that's just stone. Okay. Ah, oh, right. So 
annoying that you can't just kind of stand there and kill it because it can do all these jumps even when you're waving your sword. Oh well. Right, I need to find some more stuff. I need to actually, I should have probably actually researched before this if there's a way to tell which kind of stones are gonna like produce something. Ah, useful. He was coming straight for me. God. I just walked straight into him and lost some health. God, they are really taking my health out quick, especially this one. Ah, okay, so there's like a little copper thing, I think. No, I think that's that monster again. Is it? Let's try it. Right, okay, where should we go? I think this is a dead end. Yep. So, um, let's try hitting a few little stones. Oh, where do we go? Where do we go? That's the thing about the mines. I just, I get lost so easily. Can we break this? Oh, we can. It's taking a lot of our energy, but let's try. Are you kidding? It was just stones? Okay, it's time to eat. Is it this one that's good for you? That's 35 health. Yeah, we'll take, we'll take this one. 35 energy and 14 health. Okay. I didn't know you could eat a dandelion. Can that, <laughs> I wonder if you can eat that in real life as well. Right. I need to find if there's anything. I wonder if I can do anything with these boxes. I wonder, see if I activate like, let's put, not an earth crystal, let's put some cheap, like sap. And let's like hold on to this and see. Oh no, not eat sap. Okay, right, I'm not really sure where to go. So I'm gonna just continue breaking suspicious looking stones to see if I can find, um, like another little, uh, kind of hole thing. Should we try this one again? Let's try it. It's like in a different colour, but unfortunately it's still just giving me 10 stones. Now we need to find the way. I am fairly- ah there we go! I was just saying I'm fairly worried about my energy, so I'll eat one of these. And it's put me up a bit. Should we eat another one? Let's eat, <laughs> let's eat one more. Just get to, yeah, we're at a nice green level now, which is good. So we're gonna go down here. Oh my God. Surrounded by enemies instantly. Oh, what was that? Was that like 14? I don't actually know what, oh, and there's another tunnel, but I can see a few little things that'll be quite good, so. We're gonna... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna explore a bit more before I actually... Um, yeah, I wanna explore a little bit more before I leave and go down that bit. <laughs> that wasn't great because I just get hit. But anyway, we're gonna explore some more. What's in here, I wonder? Okay. Oh my god, there's loads of them. Die quicker! Damn. I wonder how many times it has to hit you before it slows you down. Now I wonder if each like one you kill has an another little tunnel. Nope. Okay, let's have a look over here. I'm worried I'm walking past like really expensive like stones or something. Like I can't even remember the way I found the dwarf scroll at all actually, which isn't great. Ah, there we go. This is some cop cop copper ore here. I've had a long day guys. It's, it's difficult to pronounce things. <laughs> right. I'm always like really interested in these redstones, but I don't think they're anything actually. No, unfortunately not. Anyway, we're gonna go down to the next level. 
activate that sword. Mm, let's go this wee scary way because it seems like I can... I don't know if that's a tunnel or a staircase or what but... It's, ah, it's that little box thing again. I really need to find out what that is. Like we tried to put stuff on it today and it wouldn't let us and um, we can't open it. It doesn't come up with anything either like it's broken or you know so I'm just not sure at all. Right, I'm avoiding these big stones because I feel like they're worthless. Oh, we found a geode, which is great though. And there's the little stairwell thing. So we'll go down that. What we're going to do though, just worry about my energy. I'm going to eat this. And that's put us up to yellow, so I'll take one of these. And that should hopefully... Uh, it's basically just put us to green, but I'm going to keep these for a bit. I'm really wondering how far I am in the mines. <laughs> I keep on activating the... I can't even remember what it's called, but the wrong weapon. And we've got some nice music here. Oh, this is the thing again. Oh, topaz, lovely. Now, I think we've already had topaz. But it's still good. Really? I'm gonna have to break this guy to get through. This guy is killing my energy. So I'm worried about all the enemies in here. Uh, so yeah, just gonna eat these. And another. My breath probably stinks. <laughs> okay. Wow, there's loads of stuff in here. It's really good. They kind of back me off into a corner which I don't really like. Just kind of want to get that wee flying thing out of the way. The other one. There we go. Oh my god, it's midnight. Okay. Ah! Hopefully this will be like the next kind of like level 10. I guess it goes up in fives. Do you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it a bit and what I'm gonna do is actually stay down here for a little bit and I'm gonna find out what happens when you stay awake past midnight because I, I don't actually currently know because I've never done it. You might faint. I think that's what happened in Harvest Moon. Or I think sometimes what can happen is your energy can be really low. I don't know what's worse, like, I don't know the consequences of fainting in this game, like if you lose money or if your crops wither or something. Hopefully not. Um, I'm just not too sure. I mean, probably one of the, the kind of worst things that could happen is that all your crops wither and you then, um, <laughs> you know, you miss the next day because that kind of makes it difficult. So how much space have we got? Right, we've got three spaces left. But it seems this stuff's just going to be copper ore. Um, yep, copper ore. Now I don't think this is anything we can take, but... Can't really carry it with us. I'm trying to press A, Y, no. So I don't know about that. It seems quite useful, you know, a light down in the mines, but don't know how to use it. Okay. Oh, this is solid. Oh, I, okay. <laughs> I've fallen asleep in the mine. Not great. I wonder, am I going to wake up in the mine? That'll be pretty interesting actually to find out. Oh no, we woke up back home. Oh, we lost a huge amount of money. Did we lose about 700? Okay, don't do that guys. Do not stay in the mine. I think it's about 150 we kind of cut out. I take it it's not just the mine, I take it it's like everywhere else. And then we're just going to sell stuff we got. Coal, green algae, slime, crystal, quartz, uh, copper, copper ore probably, yeah. Um, topaz, bug meat, sap. Um, and we're going to take the geode um, to be kind of opened by the blacksmith. Oh, we get 500 in clothes, which is useful. Thanks, dad. Um, and some money grandpa's, grandpa left us, which is good. Oh, dear Miss Iona, last night a Jojo, a Joja team member found you in, 
incapacitated. A medical team was dispatched to bring you home safely. We're glad you're okay. You've been building the oh, it wasn't 700, it was 997 for this service. That's quite a specific number. Thanks, Georgia. Didn't really want to, I was fine just waking up in the mines. I've killed all the enemies in that level, so it wasn't wasn't that bad, was it? The annoying thing is I think we're way too late to grow any more um, crops this season because um, when I planted the, I think it was the turnips, um, are these turnips? No parsnips, I always call them turnips, when I planted them, um, yeah it wasn't, um, when I planted them sorry, um, hold on I'm trying to see, okay so if I keep this, this hits me up 45 in energy, okay so that's probably quite good. So we'll sell this silver and these and yeah we'll sell these as well. Okay and I'm just gonna move the geode. Okay that's quite good but look at that we've lost a huge amount of energy as well so uh, we did get a lot of things and we got to a new level so I am happy that I stayed awake longer than um, I should have. I shouldn't have stayed awake till uh, I think it was like 1.50, I think at like 2am it cuts out and you lose money. So at least I, I now know. But it's a bit of a pain. It's not really that fade either. I'd rather just faint. The medical bill was huge. So what have we got today? Today is Pierre's birthday. Actually, let's have a look in the calendar. Now, I don't think we're going to have enough days um, to grow anything, unfortunately. Um, because today is our... Um, like third last day <laughs> is that right I think so um so yeah unfortunately I don't think we're gonna be able to um grow anything so it's gonna be a rough couple of days now that we've just lost a thousand oh, I thought in this episode as well that I'd make it to um 10,000 but who knows hopefully I still will be able to but I'm not sure we can't find our lover I think he doesn't come out and um, wet days unfortunately. I don't want to um, waste any energy by um, doing any fishing so I think what I'm going to do first. Mm. Now I'm, I've got two ideas. I can go to the blacksmith or I can go to the um, what is it called? It's in here. The adventurers guild. I'm not sure when that opens so and the blacksmith opens at nine. It closes at four. Do you know what? I'll go to the Adventurers Guild because I'm sure it's just straight up this way. So if I keep on going, I should be able to get there. And then what we'll do bef before we uh, leave is we can... Um, oh, what we'll do before um, we go into the mines is we'll go back to the blacksmith and get that geode opened up. It's probably nothing. I don't know if geodes are like really good to collect because when I have like took them to the blacksmith and I've sold them they've been like 15g or something. It's not really been anything that kind of expensive. So I don't know if they're worth it. I, I think you can get quite a good price for selling them just like un kind of broken just as a natural geode but it's that kind of thing that you want to know what they are first uh, before you sell it because they could be really expensive inside so yeah this is the adventurers guild and if you have a look in the map um it's at the very top hand top right hand corner of town next to the mines so it's pretty easy to find so let's go in oh it opens at two okay right so what we're gonna do now then um, it's 10 um, so I'm quickly gonna go um, back to the blacksmith so I wish I'd just known that and I'd have waited about for I don't even know how long the kind of time takes um, it was 30 minutes but it seemed that it took us what maybe two hours like game time uh, to get up here so I don't know what it'll be like in the way back um, do I think it's quicker to go down here and cross to Georgia Mart. So hopefully the blacksmiths will be open. It seems like when it rains it like stops a lot of the villagers coming out. And granted the blacksmith doesn't have to go out, but you know, I don't know. 
it's stuff like this that you a lot of these games kind of have and you don't find out until like for instance you know pears doesn't sell on a wednesday so you don't find out till it's a wednesday and you really need crops and you're like oh why okay so let's go to process geodes and we'll just put this one in these little counter oh it's copper ore okay that's not too bad we'll just keep that because we're gonna get some more of that in the mines um so yep yeah, we'll keep it and we'll make our way back up to the adventurers guild and it's 11 40 now i'll just say hi to him in the way oh cool <laughs> so yeah we'll make our way up there maybe it'll turn two by the time i don't know it, took, it was about a two hour journey game time the first time so it's 12 now so who knows it might um, and we'll go in and maybe it'll be like a wee cut screen and some information and that'll be as progressed to a new bit in the game and then we can finally go in the mines and hopefully we've reached level 10 or something. We've got to get to level 40 uh, for a kind of journal thing and I I feel like I'm nowhere near that right now. Ah, uh, So it's it's 12.30. Okay, not to waste time, I'm just going to go in the mines for a little bit. Um, yeah, so we'll just go in the mines. And f unfortunately, we're at level 5, which isn't it's not that fun. Just looking for some nice bits of copper that I can take. There's loads of those little things there. Oh, I think it's going to be one of these things that I'm just going to have to break down loads of stones. Ah, oh, there's a geode. Now, let's have a look on the th this. Yeah, it's still zero and five, which isn't great. Oh, okay, let's just kill these for fun. Oh, two enemies at once, oh no. Oh, I had them sneaking up. Okay, this one's a tough one. Okay, so we got some sap. Anyway, it's two, so we're gonna go out of the mines and go to the Adventurer's Guild. I think that's actually killed a lot of energy. But it seems to have killed a little bit. Okay, so as you guys know, the Adventurer's Guild is just over here. So we'll go in. Oh, cool. It's cozy. So our journal's updated. So, was it this bit? No. Advancement? No. Okay, I thought I was going to get money for that, but it seems not. I mean, let's have a little bit of a wander before we talk to anyone. It's just like a small kind of cabin thing. Um, Summon up here with a question mark, which we don't know. Monster eradication goals. Okay, so... <laughs> here's some of the monsters, which is a bit worrying, right? Because there's only two that's came up, and that's the slimes and the cave insects. Uh, so I think the cave insects are the kind of flying ones, or that little crab one we just killed. Um, and the slimes are the little kind of gymino looking green little apple things that run about. I don't know about the other ones. <laughs> um, I'm worried because I take it the slimes are like the most easy kill, and that's why there's a thousand of them. Um, but like for instance there's something at 50 I wonder what that's going to be like oh and there's a there's an arrow so let's have a look see Gil to claim your reward so this is Gil, this guy here oh we can get a sword sneakers that gives us defence but I kind of like our wellies topaz ring mm, it's quite expensive for stuff don't know what a wooden sword be like. Three to seven damage. Do you know what? We'll, we'll go for that and we'll equip that because we've got a rusty sword there now. Who's this? All right, okay. So apparently I was killing all those um, Jimino's things weren't enough to show him anything. Anyway, we're gonna go um, back into the mines. I'll probably you know, I'll just eat this for now. And hopefully we can get a bit lower than what we got last time. I'm just really worried about like the times because it seems that because you've got to find these little holes because we can't use the elevator all the way there, it's really difficult to get like 
what's this gonna be like? Oh, that was pretty good. That was one hit. Oh my god. But yeah, it seems like it's gonna be a bit more difficult, which I'm not loving. Damn. So uh, yeah, I feel like this is a much better sword. So I'm happy about that. Now I have a horrible feeling that the little kind of basket thing that we need will be in here somewhere. Uh, See, so yeah, I'm just gonna break a few of these down. Now I, we've not really got anything else we can eat, which is unfortunate. Um, I don't think we can eat the green algae. I should have a wee look, but I don't think we can. Um, can we? Oh, we can. We can eat it. Okay, so see if we get to I kind of bet and we feel like we need to eat it. That's fine. We can do that. Oh my god. Go away. They're kind of obsessed with you. They really do like to follow you about, which is odd. Okay, we're gonna try and find... Now, I thought it was like somewhere over here, but I do think it changes. But I'll just, yeah, I'm gonna try these stones anyway. Oh, it's difficult, you know what? Like, because they seem to change all the places, like, it's difficult to find where this thing might be. And, you know, it takes a lot of energy to break all these stones and it takes a lot of time. Like, it's already five o'clock, which I don't even know how. Does time go quicker in the mines or... See, I'd like to progress, but I just... Oh, I don't know. It's difficult. We're not even at level 10 yet. Right, come on. Where is this? Am I actually going to have to cut down every single stone in this place? I think I am. There we go. <laughs> okay, so our energy's gone down quite a bit, so I'm just going to eat this. Oh, I accidentally went down, but we can eat this now. I think it's okay. That's fine. Right. Now, I'm not going to waste energy in copper ore. What I'm going to do is try and find where this thing might be. Like this stairwell, basically. Um, because cutting stones takes a lot of time. Or not even, it takes a lot of energy, basically. I'll take this bit of copper over here. And right now, it's more about just trying to progress than find anything that, like... Oh no, damn, damn! God, we took some hit there. We went slow as well. I take it that's like their poison or something. What I don't like is they do these little jumps. They're the things that usually catch me out quite a bit. And as you can see, when they get close to you, like just there, um, it takes some of your... Ugh, that's annoying. It takes some of your kind of health away. Um, Right, let's try down here for um, maybe this little basket thing. Now, did we get further than this part? I don't think we did. Right, so I'm, I am a bit worried. Um, like I'd like to get further than this, but I'm just really struggling to find this basket thing. And there's so many stones. I wish I could play with your friends. <laughs> It'd be so much easier. Controls were really bad there for trying to hit that. Don't know why that was. Okay, maybe it's around here somewhere. We're hoping it's nearby, and um, so you know I can just get it and move on. But it doesn't seem to be. I need to find if there's like a cheat because I'm becoming like so frustrated with this. So I just want to find out where it is. Oh, and my energy's down to nothing. And unfortunately, we've got nothing to eat, so we can't progress again, which is so frustrating. So I think we're gonna have to go back up and go to bed. Oh, it's so frustrating. Like, have you guys had the same issue when you were kind of beginning in the mine that you were struggling to find how to get further? Because I'm really struggling that, like, struggling with that anyway. Like, I wanna obviously progress in the, mi the mine. This is what this video's about. 
and I've got some good things. Like I've, I think, well, I feel like it's quite good because I'm beginner. I'm a beginner, you know. I got the dwarf scroll and stuff like that, but it's just frustrating, um, because you know, I want to do good, but <laughs> Stardew Valley's not making it easy. So we're quite lucky today was a rainy day because that meant we were able to not water our crops. That's the thing, like rainy days are, you know, they've got pros and cons, like they're always really miserable, but it means you don't have to water the crops, etc. Which is really helpful, especially at this level because we don't have any sort of um, machine like a sprinkler or something um, that we can use to water the crops. We've got to all do it ourselves. Okay, so we've got a geode again. I'm just going to move that to up here. And we're going to go to bed for the night. Hopefully, maybe do like two more days in the mines. Hopefully, I'll be able to progress. I really want to because it's going to suck if we can't even get past level 10 or something. So that's pretty good. We got 1,439. So I think we're over 10,000 now, which is good. We're over 10,000. So, this has got me thinking, right? I was complaining about the mines there. And I was just thinking, right. If this is. Ugh, it surely can't be true, right? Because it just. It's so much work. Maybe they are doing it as a kind of way to make you spend longer time in the mines. But it's just. If it's real, it is so dumb. I'm probably being dumb believing it's real, but I don't know, guys. Like, it's what I'm seeing that, you know, the, the, what do you call it? The little, like, um, stairwell keeps on moving, so, I don't know. It's, it's seeming dumb to me, but maybe it's like a, <laughs> maybe it's like a plan to get you to spend more time in the mines. Who knows? Okay, let's have a look at this before we sell it. So this is 25 energy. And this is 35. Aww. Right, I'm gonna keep these, that's four, and sell these two green beans. Okay. So that means we've got some good energy to get ready to go into the mines. And what we can do as well is maybe have a little forage to see if we can find anything edible. Um, just because when we did that before in the, you know, the first kind of like, I don't know what to call it, you know, the first time we went to the mines in this video, um, it was very useful, actually. Now, I don't know, should I go? I'm thinking about just going to the mine street and leaving the geode for later because I feel like we'll find geodes anyway and we're struggling so much with time in these mines that if I just go straight now, if I just go to the mines right now, hopefully I'll get in there a good time, you know, it's only eight, maybe get in there for like nine-ish, so it'll be good, we'll have a lot more time than we usually do to get into the mines. You see if we have to go to the blacksmiths, we've ha we'll have to wait till nine anyway, so. Yeah, let's just go straight in. And we've got loads of energy, which is great. Oh, I'm back down to level five. I've already had a hit of energy, which is annoying. And we got some green algae there, so we can eat that, which is perfect. Right. I just need to continue to bang things and find this like possible staircase. Oh, there it's there, okay. What I'm just gonna try and do is keep on finding staircases. Um, I don't think it's gonna be near this bit, I don't know. Um, see, because I'm just trying to take rough guesses because there must be some kind of pattern the way they do it. I haven't figured it out yet, um, but there must be some sort of way. So, yep, I'm just gonna continue trying to break some stones because we've got lots of things to eat. Um, which is good. It's hiding. Sneaky. 
I hate that it can jump as well. I wonder if it dies quicker if like you don't run away from it kind of thing. Like, obviously that's a bit of common sense, like you don't run away or gonna kill it quicker but I'm just kind of wondering like does it oh fantastic but I was just yeah I was wondering like you know is it better to kind of stay with it and I don't know right so I think we've already we didn't get past this yesterday but I think we've actually generally passed it anyway oh and there we go oh god I'm, I'm feeling good today should be a good day it's only 10 50 now which is great come here Right, I'm gonna continue trying to break some stones and stuff to find just this passageway because it's very useful. Um, it means that you know if we are, you know if we are just done with this level kind of thing, we've not found anything. Um, you know, at least we found the passageway and we can quickly move on. And we've got some enemies here. Oh, this is like a special like slime. It's got a wee star thing very interesting. It seems like a kind of different colour. Oh my god, and it had a bigger effect on my health. I think I think it took nine. It's taking some amount of hits. Oh no. Oh my god, it's turning red eyes now. Ah! Hopefully this is the end of it. This is it's starting to get like unwell. Come on, I do not need to die. Right, okay. I know what I'm doing. That's just gonna put our health up a little bit so we can take this guy on. He's oh, he's a nightmare. There we go. Oh, and he gave us a carving knife. Okay, that's good. I think it is one of these we guys who got the wellies off of. Which is good. Right, here's a wee regular one that are actually still, like, that I still die fighting from. I wonder if you can actually die. Like, I wonder if you faint. That'd be annoying. Okay, I wonder is there anything in here? Doesn't seem so. Okay, so I'm gonna break these couple wee stones. God, that was a long jump. I'm sick of them. I'm sick of them. They're so they always get damage on me. That's super annoying. Okay, our energy bar is shaking though, so we're gonna have to. Well, let's have a quick look. This is twenty-five. Okay, they're both ten health. So, what do I need? Okay, hold on. Twenty-five energy. Okay, so they're both actually the same amount. Let's have a look at the algae. Mm, that's even lower. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, because there's nothing else we can eat, so I'm just gonna have the parsnip now and the, just one of these. Should I have another? I think, I think we'll be okay. I just need to be a bit more careful. Um, our energy's good though, so I'm happy about that. Now it's like a matter of trying to find the exit, which is a bit annoying. Okay, there's stones around here. Maybe we'll have a quick wee bang of these to see if we can find it. So it was none of them. <laughs> oh. And we're back to this kind of beginning bit again. So we're just, we've killed the enemies, which is good. We've not left any. So it means what we can do is just bang these stones to get to the next level. And we've got some things to eat, which is great. I wish some more enemies that we got gave us kind of food to eat, because unfortunately we don't have that much. We have some, which is good, but it's not a lot. Can we go in here? No. 
It's only 4.10, I'm feeling good. This is the farthest, as you guys know, this is the farthest we've got so far in the mines. But what is this? Ah. Please don't tell me it's this. It wasn't. That was so not worth- <gasps> Oh, that was it there. Okay. Right, what I'm actually just gonna do is eat the green beans because we've went down a huge amount of our energy. So, we're at equal levels for energy and health, so I'm happy about that. We can go even lower. <sighs> There's loads of enemies, oh my god. Oh, I just took my first couple hits, brilliant. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Okay, that's that one. Oh, I just got to. It seems like I've got to keep on moving when I fight them. You can't just stand annoyingly and wave your sword. It's like they want you to have good combat skills. Okay, there's. ones I can just wave my skills which is wave my sword which is good right mm, let's have a look cool mm. oh, I just why can't these just die easier the good thing is I've, I've just came face to face with so many of these enemies I feel like I'm gonna be so so close to um so so close to finishing is it gills like the amount of enemies you killed and he gives you rewards kind of thing is it him and you've got a thousand of these things to kill See, I feel like see when I get hits from it's just me being stupid. <laughs> That's the super annoying thing about it. Now I think I think we've been in here, have we? Oh guys, I don't even know. It's seven o'clock, so I'm just really, really hoping we. Oh, there we go. There's our next level. Thank God. Oh my God, what's this? Oh, we get leather boots. That's great. And there's an elevator. Can it tell us which level we're at? Reach level 10! Oh, perfect! Okay, I'm so, so chuffed about that. Okay. Now, is there anything we can eat? There's this, so I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna just move that. Put it here. Yep, and we're just gonna eat it. And that'll give us some more energy and some health, because our health has done quite a bit. And then um, we're gonna go to the next level. Oh god. I'm feeling quite good about that. I was worried in this video that I wouldn't be able to really get that many places, but I'm feeling I'm feeling good. I'm feeling like a good gamer. Oh, and I only took one hit from that. Maybe I'm getting better. Am I getting better, guys? God, they're really kind of like that was like that guy is like he's just a regular one, but he seems like a pretty formidable one. Oh, and this one's got like grass and stuff. Cool. Oh, mixed seeds looks good. Unfortunately, I don't think we'll be able to use those mixed seeds in summer, which is a bit of a pain. Anyway, it's oh my god, what the hell? <gasps> what? <laughs> I just like wave my sword frantically until it. <sighs> that was so not fun. That took so much of our health. I'm worried now that an enemy's gonna come. Um, I'll have a little hit of a few rocks and stuff to see if I can get it. There's the next level. Should we do it? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Oh god. Oh, my energy's dying for some reason. Can we eat? Can we eat this? Can we eat this? There's nothing we can eat, oh no! It seems to be going down as well. Or I don't know if it's going down or if that's just saying you're at a really low level. 
I don't know. <gasps> oh, feck no. Right, out the mine, out the mine, out the mine. <laughs> no! Oh, that was just... Oh, God! I hate the mines. I'm not happy. See if we've lost level 10 because of this. I will not be a happy bunny. Okay, so we definitely need a better weapon. But I'm just going to check the elevator just in case. Oh wait, I must have hit my head pretty hard. I've forgotten everything about the last 11 le <gasps> Oh no, you're kidding! Oh damn it, that's so bad. Let's just... Right, my energy's dying anyway, so I need to go. Right, this is so not good. We're gonna have to come back and check tomorrow. Now I just don't wanna go back in the mines. That was horrible. I might have to watch a few videos like how to deal with that bug because one attack, we were at, a, I think we were at a generally okay health. Maybe it was like, like high kind of yellows going into green. Oh. Oh, there's a guy that saved us. I think he's, is it Linus his name? And there's the midi guy. <laughs> oh, it seems Linus is going to the bins. Oh, and there's us. This is really quite sad and the wee music's making it even sadder. They're all awful. No, you should get a job and stop leeching off others. That's horrible. Yes, it's illegal. Horrible. Yes, it's disgusting. We're definitely going with, no, it's a shame for food to go to waste. Oh, what a wee sweetheart. Maybe I'll stop saying to us when we go up to him, like, I don't know you enough to talk to you. in the saloon now. We built the saloon seem to be a lot nicer though. Oh, and they're coming out. Oh, poor Linus. Oh, please be nice. Oh, I'm happy, I'm happy. Because our kind of, we walked away from that, like it was a cutscene that makes us do that, but oh. We love you, Gus. What a cinnamon roll. Okay, so it's 11 o'clock. Oh my god. And we're, we're nowhere near home. We need to get home quick because we have no energy at all. So I'm going to try and make like a quick line to, um, to home. Hopefully we can get there quick. That's so annoying. That's us back down at 9,000 all because of that bug. So that pu that bug's a, you know, it's a petty criminal. It takes money off of us, you know, everything like that. Not very nice. So is there anything we can ship? It's bug me. At least I've got five quartz, copper ore, earth crystal, sap, and fibre. But that's it. So it's not great, but we've not lost that much, thankfully. Oh, so we're gonna go to bed. Anyway, guys, do you know what? It's about 55 minutes now. I think this is quite a good place to leave the video. You know, we got to the next level in the mines. Um, we'll find out in the next video if that means, because we got attacked and we fainted, if that means that we 
have lost all of that. Hopefully it doesn't. I'm really, really hoping that it doesn't but we'll find out in the next video anyway. So I want to say thank you so much for watching this. Sorry you had to see my awful combat skills and see me die in the mines and do all these stupid things, but I've actually really enjoyed the video. I'm a wee bit scared to go in the mines now, but I'll be back next week with a kind of part two to this exploring the mines a bit deeper. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again. Bye!